Hi everyone, Cody here. Now today I'd like to run a little idea past you guys. You see I'm standing on a piece of property. It's about 40 acres in size. It's uh, next to my parents' property. I don't know how well you'll be able to see, but uh, my parents' house is down there about a mile away. The watershed's right there. I think the uh, back of their property comes to about there. And then this uh, corner here is under my name. And my my sister owns that piece over there. Anyway, I was uh, thinking that I might start a little uh, like secret science lab. You know, basically move out of my parents' house, get all my science stuff, and bring it out somewhere that if it explodes, it isn't going to bother anyone. So here I am. Now on this piece of property, there is a mine right there. It's an abandoned mine shaft. We're going to go back in the mine and have a look at that in a little while. But uh, yeah. I was thinking I could uh, have a little science lab, like uh, maybe even like a simulated Mars base. Put up some solar panels over there. Maybe cover this area with a nice greenhouse. And uh, inside, I'd be able to like, have my, you know, where I'd be staying inside the mountain there. Yeah, I think it'd be like a Minecraft Let's Play sort of thing. I might start a new channel, or I might even. Just put a playlist on my current channel since it's already kind of popular. And just see how far I get tech wise, right? <laughs> you know, live off the land, see what I can do. I was thinking maybe I could call it uh, Cody's Lab or perhaps Reader's Lab and uh, have on there off off grid living because my parents, they're living off the grid and this is off off grid. <laughs> It would be completely secluded from the rest of the world. Let's uh, go ahead and head over to this mine, see how it looks inside. I've been in there before, a few years ago, and everything. It's a pretty simple hole. Let's see if it's still open. There's some weeds there. And... Okay, it's closed. I'll have to dig it back out. Get some of these weeds out of here. It's, well, it's actually kind of open. I can see into it, but it's not a big enough hole that I could get down in there. See out front here, you got a bunch of clay. See, and uh, when the water hits it, the clay falls down because there's no support structure. In fact, uh, the bottom of the mine is about this level that my feet are on right here. So all this material right here would have to be dug out in order to access it. And then I'd have to build a structure around a porthole to keep it from collapsing in again. Uh, it wouldn't be too much to dig it out. I might even do that today. If I do, I'll go ahead and attach a video on there of us going inside. I'm sure you'd all be interested in that. <laughs> you know, this may not be something I'll do until summer, or perhaps... Uh, I'm, not, I'm not sure what I'm doing over the summer. It might even be later than that. But it might be a little fun little project I'd like to do. Even if it's just a couple of weeks, you know, like do like a simulated Mars mission. I think that'd be something awesome. Uh, I want to try pressurizing the hole, you know, lining it with plastic or something, or maybe concrete, and then pressurize it to a third atmosphere, and like pretending that the outside world is Mars, you know. Yeah, this is the mine dump. This is the stuff that came out of that mine. I might go grab a shovel and go ahead and dig that out. Oh. See you then. Okay. Looks like the camera lens is fogged up. Let's see if I can fix that. A little better. Anyway, here I am inside the hole. You see, I just dug it out. There's my shovel. Not sure the camera's going to last long, so let's uh, get back in here pretty quick. Yeah. Looks like the solid rock starts to start about here. Yeah, this is pretty solid rock in here. Sure moist. Anyway, that's a pretty simple hole. See the back there? The mouse nest. Right, here's the back. Camera keeps fogging up. It's so moist in here. It's got to be at 60 degrees. It's amazing. So yeah, 
I don't know how well you guys saw that, but uh, here we are. Looks like a nice little cozy hole. Could definitely make this little, make it work. Yeah. <laughs> Looks like covering the sides in plastic is going to be hard because see how pointy those rocks are. That may not be something I'm able to do. Yeah, just looking at rocks. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to get out of here for now. It's a little fun little thing. Hope you all agree. See you next time. <laughs> Just as I was leaving, I heard a noise. Looks like I'm not the only one that wants to call this place home. <laughs>